Hello, I want to welcome you to the online marketing tutorial videos part two. In this set of videos and this course, we go a little bit further into the setup of your website, some things that you should know about regarding cPanel, which is your control panel of your hosting account. So we just wanted to take things a little bit further, just have you have a better understanding of more of a website setup and some of the things that you can do really quick and easy inside of cPanel to build out a really good looking website. So in this video, we are going to take a look at your cPanel and just kind of go through some of the different options that are involved in cPanel. So let's head over to our website. All right, so what I'm going to do in order to access my cPanel, I simply just need to put a forward slash and type in cPanel on the end of my URL. Once I have my URL set up for looking for the cPanel, I just need to put in my username and password. My username and password are found with all of my server details. If you watched my last video set or um, took the last course on online marketing tutorial videos, then you know that I set up my server and I had these username and, and password details when I set up my server. So let me go ahead and click OK. Now I have my RoboForm password uh, trying to pop up there. So that's what that was. But what I have here is my server for online marketing tutorials. And you can see here, that's my main domain. Okay, sorry about that. Now inside of here, it, I can do a number of different things. Okay, so let's just go. Uh, one thing that I never realized for a long time was the fact that you can move these things around. They're, very, they're drag and drop. So if you find yourself working in cPanel, and you're using your file manager or you know you're checking your web stats whatever the case may be you can move these things around and it'll be very helpful but the cPanel is basically your control panel for your website it contains all your information it allows you to manipulate to set up emails so you have your email accounts here you can log into your webmail your email forwarders you have your stats. There's video tutorials here on how to use everything. Um, there's add-on domains. There's database setup. And we're going to cover a lot of these things in the, in the next few videos. But I just wanted to give you a different look. And you can also switch the theme. Uh, depending on your server, uh, we have in our hosting account a couple of different themes to just give a different look to your cPanel. So your cPanel may look like this, or it may look like the X3, which is the default in my hosting account. So I don't want you to freak out. They contain the exact same uh, specifications and everything is the same. They just give it a different look. So that's pretty much it. I just wanted to introduce cPanel to you and just get you excited because at the end of the online marketing tutorial video course part two, you're gonna be able to do so much more than in part one, and hopefully you'll be real comfortable with really taking your business to a new level. So I look forward to seeing you in the next videos.